welcome to another NCCS YouTube video. My name is Emmanuel and I'm an application engineer here at NCCS. Today I'll be showing you our newest product line, Flux. Now, first off, what is Flux? Flux is an offline bending software for your press break, which provides a very simple and user-friendly workflow, allowing you to import multiple file types at the same time, convert your part to sheet metal, sequence, troubleshoot and simulate your job, as well as generate the NC code and much more. So let's get right into it. First thing I'll be showing you is the flexibility that Flux provides you when importing files. As you can see here, this folder contains 17 files of multiple formats. You have your DXF, IGES, SolarWorks, 2D and 3D files. And what you're about to see is that Flux can import them all at the same time. I just select all and click import. And as you can see here, all 17 files were imported in just over one second averaging approximately 0.06 seconds per file. We have also tested this for 100 different files and all of them were successfully imported in well under 10 seconds. I'm sure you can imagine that not having to discriminate between file types will greatly speed up your work process, making Flux that much more user friendly. Now I'm going to show you the simple process taken to generate an NC code for your part. First, I click on the workflow icon and right away Flux gives me the ability to convert to sheet metal at the click of a button. Once a sheet metal part, Flux allows the user to unfold their part for a flattened view. When flattened, you can see the bend lines along with the angles that each segment will be bent. Flux also allows you to select your machine from a vast database containing machine brands from Amada to Yahweh. Just select your machine, click the plus symbol, and there you go. Sequencing your part has also been greatly simplified. When you select your machine, Flux auto-sequences the part for you. However, if you want to see or change the order in which your part is being sequenced, you simply select the sequence icon and Flux will show you how your part is being sequenced. Flux will also provide you with a visual of your machine as well as what your part will look like as it's being bent. Just drag your mouse to the top where the numbers 1, 2, 3, 4 are, representing your bending sequence, and hit play. Now, before we hit play, I'd like to focus your attention to the 3 which is being highlighted. This is one of the ways Flux is telling you that an error will occur. To find out what the error is, simply hover your mouse over the 3 and it will display what is going wrong. And as you can see, the part is colliding with one of the clamps. So, I'm just going to slow it down a little bit. And now I'm going to run the simulation. Now, some of you may have noticed that during step 3, one of the clamps was highlighted in red. This is Flux showing you which specific clamp the part is conflicting with, and to change it, we simply go back to step 3 by clicking on the column 3, select the clamp, and click remove. It's as simple as that. Now I'm just going to reposition the clamps and run through the simulation again. Once we're happy with that, we can then go ahead and generate the NC code. To do this, we simply go back into Workflow and click Post Process. To view the NC code, we go into Workflow again and under Bend Outputs, we can click View NC Code. And for those of you who can read the NC code, there it is. Flux also has the capability to automatically generate a bend report. By going back into Workflow and selecting View Bend Report, Flux will generate a report containing information such as the tools you've used, sequences, package distances, and more. And that is a brief introduction to the software that is Flux. If you have any questions about the software itself or 
anything related to Metacam, SolidWorks or CamWorks, please feel free to give me a call or send me an email. Hope this video helped and have a great day.